Come bless the Lord, all you servants of the Lord, you that by night stand in the house of the Lord. Lift up your hands towards the sanctuary and bless the Lord. The Lord who made heaven and earth give you his blessing out of Zion. Thus may the Lord Almighty, our God and Saviour, grant us a quiet night and a perfect end. For our help is in the name of this Lord, who made heaven and earth. As we come to the end of this day, we acknowledge our need of forgiveness. And so together we say, most merciful God, we confess to you before the whole company of heaven and one another that we have sinned in thought, word and deed and in what we have failed to do. Forgive us our sins, heal us by your spirit and raise us to new life in Christ. Amen. With the confidence that our requests are answered, we say before the ending of this day, Creator of the world, we pray that you with steadfast love would keep your watch around us while we sleep. But before we sleep, we long to hear from God in his word. Tonight we listen to some verses from Psalm 77, where we read, When I besought the Lord with pleading hands, my soul refused comfort. Unable to sleep, I was speechless. In the dark night, I asked whether the Lord had abandoned me and forever. The sense of spiritual desertion is one which sometimes accompanies the pilgrim road. Many of us can identify with the experience of the psalmist, or if we cannot, we need to sympathize with those who do and remember that our master trod the same path when he cried out, my God, my God, why have you forsaken me? Lord Jesus, when darkness surrounds us, when your father and ours seems so far away. Comfort us in our agony. Reassure us of your presence or at the very least grant us the faith to pass through our present hell. Abide with us, Lord Jesus, for the night is at hand and the day is now past. As the night watch looks for the morning, so do we look for you, O Christ. So may the Lord our God, Father, Son and Holy Spirit bless us and watch over us. May the Lord make his face shine upon us and be gracious to us. May the Lord look kindly on us and give to us his peace.